Hey guys, um, in this video I'm going to show you Cookies Home Tab version 1.8.5. Um, it has recently been updated, it was at version 1.8.0 um, I think around two weeks ago, uh, the other day it was updated and before that it was at 1.7 uh, point something I think um, the 1.8 update I haven't covered in the video but uh, the difference between 1.8 and 1.8.5 are some bug fixes and a few additional features so I'm gonna just cover the main features um, in the updates instead of going through all the features as I've already got a video on the cookies home tab um, the Cookies Home tab does come with an updated version, or does have one, it doesn't come with it, you have to download it separately. Uh, updated version of the CHT editor, which is Cookies Home tab editor. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to go straight in. This thing you will probably notice is on my home screen, if you look across the top, the taskbar there actually is skinned, or has a, a theme or a wallpaper. One of the this is one of the options you can actually set in the new Cookies Home tab update. You can set the soft key bar at the bottom and the taskbar to actually have a wallpaper. As you can see in mine, I've set my background to the same one that I have on the taskbar and soft key. So it sort of you can see a little line here goes up, round, and all the way up and across. So it looks you know it looks pretty cool, pretty cool wallpaper. Um, swiping up to my initial home screen you may notice that I do have something here this is a music widget you can play go to the previous song go to the next song shuffle or repeat tells you the uh, song name there and the album art you can also put um, a, another page above this you can choose how many pages you want. Swiping up here I have another widget. It's the same one, it's the music widget but a little larger. This is done by um, tapping and holding the same as you would in 1.7 and 1.8. You tap, you hold, add a widget, add the music player and then press next and it'll give you more options. You can have a big one, a small one, or a medium one. I'll quickly show you that now how to change it. So you go to menu, edit home layout, choose the screen that you're on. If I tap and hold there you see it says previous next and removed. If you tap next you get a smaller one. Oops. Next again you get a really small one and back to the original. Then press done when you're finished. You can also have um, another screen like you saw here when you go to edit home layout you choose which screen you want to uh, edit you can have one, two, three or four and you can also have screens across left and right but that's an option that I've changed in CHT so that I've only got one all the way up and down if I flick to the right, <clears throat> to the right screen, um, you see I have toggles here. Disconnect data, restart sense, restart device, Winmo settings, messages, email, call history, voicemail, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, vibrate, silent, lock device, flight mode and phone. These toggles all come with the CHT editor. No, um sorry uh, they actually come with cookies home tab mod in the options you go to edit quick links and you can add these in so tap a blank one there see it says notification icon so when you get a message it shows a little bubble in the corner how many messages you have same with toggle switch but you can add those in and you get a little on off switch there uh, pretty cool. Miscellaneous. Uh, this is another feature here. 
you can update tasks, you can go to previous wallpaper, next wallpaper or random wallpaper so you can actually change the wallpaper um, just from adding a quick link which is a pretty cool feature from the menu you can set wallpaper for the home tab you can do it in case if you have a ROM that supports landscape you can also do the landscape wallpaper uh, you can change the lock screen wallpaper you can set a wallpaper to uh, span across all tabs a skin taskbar and soft key together skin only taskbar and skin only soft key bar which is pretty useful um, I believe that uh, that's about it really, they're the new features of the home tab um, I'll leave the link in the description as per uh, you'll be able to download it and I will also leave a link to the XDA forum so I'll see you guys in the next video if you like this video comment, like and if you want to see some more then don't forget to subscribe